This is how most people want to see a gopher, dead. But the truth is, gophers are pretty interesting animals, albeit they won't win a beauty contest. Gophers live underground and rarely see the light of day. They are excellent diggers and make a network of tunnels that allow them to eat roots and tubers. Plants get attacked from above and below. Deeper into the ground, gophers make a sleeping suite, food storage rooms, and a bathroom. Gophers are probably the most solitary animal in the world, and each tunnel system is defended by a single gopher. For a gopher, it's all about the smell. Gophers have external cheek pouches for transporting food items like these small roots. Adaptations for a life underground include lips that close behind the front teeth and large tear glands that wash out dirt from their eyes. Also, their ability to run as fast in reverse as in forward is useful if they encounter a weasel or a snake coming down the tunnel. When gophers get into a garden or agricultural area, they go from cool wildlife to pest. And they are really not welcome at the golf club. There are four species of gophers in Costa Rica, two of which have white markings like this Cherie's gopher. Our friend here has found the tuber of an aracache, an Andean crop that is grown in Costa Rica. Picadillo de Arracache is traditionally served at Costa Rican weddings in the countryside. Gophers are not invited. Gophers just go apeshit over this. Notice enough of the tuber is left so it'll keep on growing. Well, a man's got to eat. <laughs>